Good morning, this is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, we are going back to the sport smartwatch from Z Blaze. So we have here is the Z Blaze Ares. And this time, we are going to show you uh, the process on how to install the support app for the sport smartwatch. So let's see. Let's check if it works with the iOS platform. The last time we installed this, we used the or we installed the app on the Android smartphone. So this time we're going to install it on the iOS. Okay. To be able to do that, we have to download the support app. So let's check the support app for this one. As you can see here. It is the Glory Fit app available available in Android and what we are after is the iOS. So we have here the iOS 9.0. So let's check it out and install the app for the Android platform. So we have here the phone. Okay, so let's try to install the app. Again, what's the name of the app here? Okay, do you still remember? So we have the Glory Fit. So let's search the Glory Fit here. Glory Fit app. Glory Fit. Okay. So we have here the logo is the same with the logo here on the user manual. Okay, so not one. Okay, it's a bit different here. Okay, let's check again. But they have the same. Okay, the same name here. So we'll see. Maybe it is just an update. So let's see. And we already have installed here the Glory Fit. Okay, let's check. So Glory Fit app. Maybe it is an update. Well, maybe let's see so I have here the glory fit app okay it's we also installed this with the other applications or with the other smartwatch so let's uninstall this and see so we'll have a clean install okay so let's check let's download it again and let's turn on the Bluetooth here okay it's already turned on let's see and install again for the glory fit app it is a sport smart watch okay lightweight if you are a cyclist or if you love outdoor activities so this one is a very good partner for your outdoor sports so it is water resistant classic looking lightweight looking like a one of the classic smartwatch from uh, Timex, I think, or Casio. Okay, looking good. Durable body here, breathable strap, and it is loaded with a lot of features. So, aside from the button here, okay, do you see it here? We have at least two buttons. You can also navigate on the smartwatch with a touch screen interface here okay so for the sports function here so let me see okay let's check we have here on the training so we have a lot of options for the sports uh, seems like the we already completed and download the app here okay so let's open the app Again, this is Glory Fit for iOS. Okay, so email a code. So agree. Skip. Okay, I'm not going to sign up or register. Uh, okay, so it is a permission allow Glory Fit to access your location only while using the app. So this is the GPS asking for the activation. Okay, 
So, we are on the UI now of the GloryFit device or GloryFit app. So, third party service here. Okay, link to Apple Health. So, it has a feature for that one. What else? Support here. Seems like it also supports connected GPS. And we have here the sleep data here. So, let's connect the device. So, tap on the device option here. GloryFit would like to send you notifications. Allow. Okay, so we have please add a device in order to record data. Add device. Select device. So, so it's now searching. So it's already here. Aries ID6D92 with a MAC address here on the bottom. Just as the signal is good here. Tap on the device and let's see if it's flawlessly connected. Okay. Again. So the device it is connecting. Let's wait. So while we are waiting for the connection, seems like it's taking some time. Okay. Okay, red cry. Okay. So is it connected? We'll see. Let's check this one. Okay. Is it connected? Here we have the battery, but it's it shows a notification that it is disconnected. Okay, let's try. Okay, light up. Open dashboard. We'll see, let's change the watch face here. Yeah, I like this one. It looks like a an Apple Watch watch face. Synchronizing. We'll see. Okay, so you still have to download. Let's see if it's successfully connected. Again the the smart watch. I love the smart watch. I've been using it for my outdoor activities. Very lightweight, easy to use and navigate. Okay. I think uh, this is one of one of my favorite smartwatch from Z Blaze. Okay. And their sports smartwatch category. Okay, beautiful. I love the design. There's a lot of options. The watch faces available. Okay. Although I'm using the Android platform app. Okay. So we have a lot of features here. We have a lot of options. Okay, especially for the sports training. Okay. So we are still waiting. Okay, as you can see here, synchronization complete. So let's see if it's connected to or downloaded to our smartwatch. Okay, so it's here. Oh, I didn't expect it is an animated watch face here. Beautiful watch face. Okay, so far it works. And there's a lot more options. There's a lot of options here. For the watch face from analog to digital watch faces. Seems we also have a custom dial here. Okay. So, so far, as you can see here, the smartwatch app is similar to the Android platform also. Okay. We, with some few issues, I think, with the connectivity. Okay. On the Android platform, it is pretty smooth okay no issues of disconnecting maybe i have a an old os here for the ios as you can see there on the platform you need at least 9.0 and above platform okay although i have a latest but the hardware here because this is an old iphone 6 smart phone Okay, maybe with a 
latest app or latest smartwatch or uh, iOS no maybe there's no issues of the connectivity or maybe with this firmware update okay if we have so we already have the newest version if they will send a new firmware update maybe these issues will be completely gone okay but so far as you can see it is connected okay hopefully it will have a stable connection with a smartwatch so let's change the screen time out here okay so far okay everything works including the installation of the watch face okay for the notifications here we also have okay and other options they also have the heart rate here okay so so far everything is okay except from few issues of the disconnection in the iOS platform as you can see but the app is okay here okay you all have the details you can also connect it with a WeChat here and link to Apple help okay so that's it again if you have any questions with the smartwatch as well as the app please drop a comment below and we will answer your queries Goodbye.